In the port, I found Crest, the mechanic Katya mentioned before. He told me more about the local fanatics and promised to help us if we take him aboard. He is also heading east. The main problem now is crossing the bridge, as the fanatics that built their shantytown on it are very unlikely to just lower it to let the Aurora through. Still, I have a more pressing problem now. Anna went off the grid. I'm quite sure she's all right, but we can't afford to grow complacent here. The last time she used the radio, she was approaching a small hillock with some antennas. Right then, so, it is evening, and I need to go in all sorts of directions, honestly. Um, yeah, can I, uh, where's the, ah, yes, this is what I'm looking for. So, fine, Jesus Christ, all right, <laughs> there we go, find Anna, but there's also other things I need to do, isn't there? Maybe, potentially. Wait, so you're telling me she's over there, and not over there. For some reason, I had a sneaking suspicion that she was in that general direction, based on what uh, what the mechanic in, in the port told me, but I don't know, maybe that's just me being incompetent and uh, unable to follow simple instructions. Who knows? Now, I do have a little bit of ammo for the Kalashnikov, and I have cleaned the, uh, oh, hello. I have cleaned my guns as well. So, she should be right up there. Then, eh? So I guess we avoid the huge electrical thingamajig. It's heading straight towards me, though. <laughs> Is there a ladder? Can we climb this? No. Yeah, that's heading straight towards me. Okay. Where to now? Oh, she's here, all right, supposedly. Somewhere around, at the very least. Did she make it in to the to the sort of safe house area that I found previously? Potentially. Hello. Well, that'll be a no, but, uh, I can sleep here, I can craft stuff here. Also, apparently I missed that. Yeah, I haven't the faintest where she is, honestly. 
Honey! <laughs> Sweetie! Alright, so the, um... Let's call it a anomaly. Based off of no previous experience whatsoever. So the anomaly has a fairly regular pattern. I think, so this is... Well, to me at least, looks relatively safe. Plus, it doesn't move that quickly, so... What the hell? Yeah, regular pattern my ass. If you'll excuse me, where the sodding hell is my wife? To this down here. What? Are you mental? Yeah, all right. Glad I didn't go after the other thing first. I heard you call me. It was so great there. <laughs> what? What on earth are you talking about? Shut up, you hallucinating woman. Alright, what have you gotten me into now? Now you just cough it up and uh, I will... What the hell did I just throw? I threw some, didn't I? Oh, it was a knife or a, a can of some sort or something. Yeah, all right, I, I've completely forgot about those. I was going to pick this up if I can. And I can. All right. Give me my knife back. Yep, take it as much. There's something moving in the water, but honestly that's like standard nowadays, so really no reason to get excited, eh? Something killed that thing. Minute left on the filter, don't worry. Filters, I have a plethora of. What I don't have a plethora of. Medkits. Grab that. Uh, 
at the absolute least, I am uh, aiming relatively well. So, there's that. One round. Oh, what? Are you kidding me? Really? Seriously? Lesson learned, go for the head. All the time, every single time, without exception. But sodding hell, that was... Yeah, Alright, two rounds, lovely, that'll make a world of difference. Got him. Got him. And there I was thinking like burst fire and stuff like that. Well, I don't know. Suppress them, I guess. Doesn't make a lot of sense in hindsight. Don't worry so much about the flashlight. Keep going. Don't worry about air, because uh, it is a finite supply. Very much so. Alright, we've opened the other way. We haven't. Okay. Yeah, all right. Oh, what is this place? See the barrels? The chemicals of some kind. This place is either for storage. No. Shoot. How do you I'm sorry. Just rest a bit and get going. <laughs> the 
old man's probably going seven sorts of crazy now, thinking his precious daughter got hurt or something. Well, I mean, she did uh, well. Depends on what you mean by her, but. Dad, it's me. My radio battery died. I got it wet. Other than that, I'm fine. Artyom and the guys are here. You'd think he'd get used to, to, to stuff like this. <laughs> Head back. Help Stepan persuade my father about letting Katya and Nastya travel with us. Mm, why would I do that? All right, fine. I am feeling better now. Really, I am. Fine. Fine. Um. I don't exactly believe you, but fine. Alright. Did, did the electrical thing disappear as well? Yeah, apparently. Alright. Fair enough, I suppose. Let's go. Didn't see me. Where's the exit? No, no, keep sleeping, keep sleeping. Should have kept sleeping, mate. Alright, run for it. Should be somewhere over here, yep. Yeah. Is the uh... bit of train? Get this feeling something's behind me. No, no. All right. Never hurts to be overly careful. Case in point is lying in a toxic dump somewhere over there, and is apparently my wife. <laughs> hey, man. Katya and Nastya come with us, even though Katya told us where to find a passenger car in great condition. Oh, we could use a passenger car, not just for them two, but for me as well. We... we have to go back now, I guess. Where... where would you go? Those fanatics would eat you alive. Man, that looks kind of... kind of good. I'm not gonna lie, like that... considering the conditions, that looks kind of good. Yeah, we're not letting a, a kid go back there, now. Open up. Hold on. By the way, I just noticed... Did I... Did I comment on your name before? Yeah, I, I like it. It fits the character a little bit too much, though. Kind of. Kind of. I need to talk you and I. Yeah, speaking of which, Katya, not the bridge. Oh! Well, look who arrived. We can't leave the child here. And anyhow, how long are we going to sleep in turns for? 
Are you starting that again? How? Huh? How are we going to collect that carriage? I'm not taking the Aurora there. Well, we're going to sleep in turns forever, aren't we? I mean, we, we are a military train, to all intents and purposes. Plus, with the wildlife and everything. <laughs> no, oh, I'm kidding, of course I will. I always handle it. If the caravan is sighted, drop everything and rush to the port. It's our best chance of traversing the bridge. Thanks, Dad. Katya and Nasia will be so grateful. Right. It's a breaker for the rail car. It won't run without this. She's a real babe, Artyomich, no two ways about it. We went to hell and back, Her and I. So much stuff you hold, so many tight spots she saved me from. Look, Atyok, since you're going to the terminal, hear me out. It's quite a distance away, and look, if you go at night, there's less of a chance you might run into bandits. They stay at their camps when it's dark. But All right. it's not going to be easy either, since more beasts come out and there are also electrical anomalies. The fanatics call them the demons of electricity, so you should think about your options before heading out. Oh, I'm going to sleep. Artyom, Duke is on a mission in that area. He's keeping tabs on the bridge. The reception is bad there. We get mostly static from him. Anyway, if you meet him, he'll update you on the latest developments in the terminal. Right. I bet you've conspired with Anna and Stefan. I care for those two no less than you. But you don't know if what's ahead is any better than the fanatics. I guess we'll have to live and see. Aye. Um, here's the thing. Great job persuading the old man. Spasiba. Look, um... Oh, that was just what I was about to ask. Thank you. Alright, let's craft one med kit. Craft two filters. Don't need any of these. I could use some ammo. Doesn't lose air if the pressure is above normal. Yes, please. Oh, all right, lovely. Reflex sight. We put that on. Um, Eighteen steel balls or six capsules. All right, let's do that. No gadget. Tikar. Ah, right. Okay. Um, and we want this as well. Cleaning, there is... doesn't need to be cleaned. My gun needs to be a little bit cleaned. Or my, my other gun, you know what I mean? Uh, Kalashnikov. Oh, so I can replace the Kalash with some kind of other weapon in, in the inventory. Right, 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 right. So you, so you do actually collect all the weapons I... We don't collect the weapons I find, but you collect weapons on your own period, I suppose, is... is how that works. Alright. We want the suppressor on this thing, and uh, there's pretty much nothing else to do. Yeah, this this is good. I like the way this, this looks. Everything's fine with the gun's armor, though. Yeah, I need to repair the gas mask a little bit, because it got damaged. And this is all fine. So, we're going to go and we're going to fight some bandits, apparently. Um, demons or um, uh, monsters and animals and stuff like that comes out at night. So, we're going to be fighting mostly humans. As a result, I would like a little bit of ammo. Uh, 
Yeah. That'll help. Alright. Bolshe spasiva. Yeah, you'll love you'll handle the uh, dealing with dealings with the civvies, won't you? Hi, RTM. How are you, Horosho? <laughs> that was the worst Horosho I have heard in a while. It's almost as if you're not Russian, uh, <laughs> uh, Ukrainian, probably, right? Or uh, no, a Mongol. Uh, look, it's just jokes aside, we are going to two different places, actually. Alright, so we're going to check the question mark there, which I've completely forgotten what it is, but supposedly there is something interesting there. And we're going back there, but back up there as well. Here's the thing, though. It's night, and I, would it be too much to ask for a bed on the train? Thank you. Are you, you still not done thanking us? Like, really? Can I just... I don't know, can I wait it out here? Da, um, look. Can I sleep here? Anywhere? No? I can't sleep here. You want me to go into a nest of demons? I miss Daddy so much. The, the fucker wants me to go to a nest of demons to find a teddy bear. Are you kidding me? Fine, we'll go to the nest of demons to bring your teddy bear back. Well, hold on. What, you just realised that sounds insane? No, 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 no. If they took a teddy bear there to the young uns, they probably took something else, didn't they? As in, there's probably supplies there, and the likes. Does that make sense to anyone else? Just me? Hmm. I like that, that idea very much. So, we'll go with it. Here's the... Hold on, what am I doing? Hold on. Also, uh... Yeah, I'll snatch that if you don't mind. Now, there is a boat here I can use to traverse wherever the hell I'm supposed to be going next. But can I use the, uh... Can I just cross, like, there? Maybe the train can't, but, but I can. I haven't actually checked the front of the train yet. Mind you, it's not much of a train, it's a locomotive, and that's pretty much it. Hey, love. I haven't really thanked you properly for saving me from that stupid cellar yet. I, I get the feeling I'm gonna be hearing this this sort of line of Because I knew you'd come and save me no matter what. Thank you, my love. Now, go. Come back soon, and stay away from the hotspots. A radiation? Yeah, I'll, I'll try. Um, mind you, I don't have a guide counter. Uh, oh, no, I do, I do, never mind. Yeah, we can, we can go through here. Uh, you going to the terminal? You might meet Duke there. He's got an observation post set up in a carriage near the bridge. Carriage near the bridge, got it. for a sit -trap before going in. Mm-hmm. That tower to the right, see it? Yep. There's someone over there. I think it's the bandits. They're watching us. Uh, we heard someone playing guitar over there. Those guys can't play for shit. <laughs> Stefan wanted to take the instrument from them. They were butchering the melodies so badly. <laughs> so, Sounds about right. Make an old friend happy. Stefan is a wizard to the sixth day. He plays some mean classic rock. Oh, alright. Yeah, this is like, this is now actually a very viable weapon. Thank you. I was listening, I swear I was listening. Uh, 
But it's just I'm, I'm checking my gear before I head out. Um, so yeah, about that though, about the tower. They're probably sleeping now, aren't they? So, let's go all sneaky. Need to get closer if we're going to use this on him. But yeah, like I was saying, considering they're probably sleeping now, at least most of them, let's go all sneaky and... Spokojnie noci. Put the, uh... Put the extra pellet in there. But like I said, there's now a very viable weapon, considering, like, this is a sniper now. Like, practically it is. It's a pneumatic sniper. As long as it's fully charged... It doesn't lose air pressure anymore, so it's not like a high maintenance thing. Yeah, this this is an awesome weapon now. One small issue with doing this at night. I'd love to check the trains, I really would. For supplies and ammo and the likes. I don't think I can do it though. Okay, let's check the map before we continue going in any direction. Uh, yeah, so we check that off, we keep going, and yeah, yeah, alright, this is, this is fairly simple. This is fairly simple. This is from A to B, right? This is... this is alright. And actually... Let's put it further, you can holster your weapon and render myself defenseless now. Thank you. See what we can see. So there is a guy there with a flashlight. Guy up there, guy up there. So we should enter through the left. Sort of bit, I suppose. Alright. Let's go and do that then.